Hey, 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 man. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out, man. Look, I'm gonna be reacting to Did Lil Dirt sacrifice King Von, man? Did he? Did King? Did Lil Dirt? A lot of people say Dirt sacrifices homies, bro. A lot of niggas be saying he, uh, every time one of his homies die, one any time his homie die, one of his albums come out. Anytime his homie, anytime one of his friends die, he rise up in fame, man. I don't know, bro. I don't think that's really true, but maybe this video can convince me otherwise, man. So, without further any further ado, let's check it out. In this video, I will be answering that question. I'm sure most of you have seen TikToks and tweets with evidence that Lil Dirk sacrificed gun. I see that shit. In this video, I will be analyzing the most popular evidence. Now, there is so many reasons people think Dirk sacrificed gun. I want to be able to discuss them all. So, I'll only be addressing the best evidence given by the TikTokers that popularized the video. Don't see any hangover to the TikToker. Make sure you like and subscribe to support the channel. Enjoy the video. Alright, so let's look at this King Von song where he predicted his own death. But none of that shit happened in his death, though. Like, <laughs> that's just a story. You know, King Von tells stories and shit, so he told, he's giving a story for y'all niggas. You know what I'm saying? There ain't no death thing, and none of that stuff actually happened, happened on his actual death. That's not how his actual death went down. I don't care about you. Yo, wasn't there a video that stole all his jewelry? After Von died, he stole all his jewelry, his own man. That shit fake, bro. There's two points I need to address here. The first is that Killing Von. What he said, I need to go back. I need to get all the goddamn the context in this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? I need to get all the goddamn context. In it, Von. Wait, what the fuck? I still didn't read that shit. There's two points I need to address here. The first is in that King Von song playing is. The first is that King Von song playing is Ride. In the, in it, Von isn't pre predicting his isn't predicting his own death. He's talking about when he got arrested in O Block for the Atlanta shooting. So he got in a shooting in Atlanta uh one time before. This some shit that I ain't even know. I ain't even know he got the shooting in Atlanta. Or uh, another time before he had died, I thought this is the first time he got to shoot in Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? I ain't know no other incident that happened, bro. This is my first time hearing about this shit, bro. It's crazy, the shit that I don't even hear about, bro. Like, bro, this shit crazy. took his jury. I knew that shit wouldn't happen. I knew they ain't take your fucking jury. I knew that shit was fake. I knew they was lying about this shit. Von cousin confirmed that Von wasn't wearing any jury the night that night and Von little bro got his chain and probably all his other jury. Yup. They probably have you know what I'm saying that go down to the family. The same day Lil Dirk dropped back in blood, King Von died. It's not a coincidence. This was definitely a that song was recorded. Yeah, hell yeah, because the song was already out before they put the uh fucking music video out. You know what I'm saying? They just put the music video out. They been recorded the song, and I think they had the audio. Out. Yeah, they had the audio out already, man. That's that's another fucking cap. You know what I'm saying? That's another cap right there. Dirt did it plan for it to drop that day. So I already talked about King Von dissing Lil Durk's dead cousin, Lil Mista. But King Von also paid his respects to the man who allegedly killed oh, five, Lil Durk's man. cousin, Nooski. That nigga Melly. <laughs> now he one of them niggas you can talk to, you know what I'm saying? You can talk to him because he, he cool. Right, and he got little points, whatever he did, you know? So it's, just, it's, 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 it's okay. 
This clip is pretty out of context because Vaughn is paying respects to Melly telling Vaughn that Vaughn had to beat his case because Vaughn's best friend Troy got killed. Paying respect. Okay. Vaughn hated Melly not just because of what Melly did on the streets, but also because Melly started dating Vaughn's ex. Mm. He fucked that nigga ox. You know what I'm saying? Melly, as you know what I'm saying, Melly, Vaughn ox. So, Melly, Vaughn is Melly ox. So, he said, you know what I'm saying? He fucked this ox. Right. But one of the ops died. Vaughn dissed Melly's death in a couple songs and even said at the end. I thought that's some real shit. Well, bitch ass, I bet sick of play, okay, that. If you didn't know, it was always a rumor that King Vaughn killed Lil Mister, Lil Dirk's cousin. Hey, my homie think I killed his cousin, well, oh, well. First off, it was never a rumor. Vaughn killed Lil Mister. Also, even if Vaughn would have would have mentioned it on the song with Dirk. Hey, he said fuck Lil Mister anyway. Now listen to this Lil Durk song that dropped after Vaughn died. It was on his album. Durk is talking about Millie, the first song who alleged the first. Vaughn wasn't shot in the kidney either. He was shot in the torso and thighs. Finally back in blood. Was dirt was dissing M P U B U crump back in blood was recorded before Von died, so he obviously not dissing Von. I mean, he could have, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Even though it's not true, he could have been like, you know what I'm saying, dissing Von because he could be predetermining his death. You know how in Illuminati and shit, niggas can like. Sacrifice nigga be like, oh, this nigga gonna die, so he probably, but that ain't none of that shit true, so, I don't know what I'm saying, but he didn't do that, but like, what they saying is, he could have probably predicted this man death saying he gonna die, you know what I'm saying, that wood, by saying that. First things first, let's take a closer look at the court case they had together. And whose real name is Dirk Derek Banks, and his co the rapper and Bennett listened to the evidence against them in court, police told you can clearly see Vaughn mad at Dirk for talking. In my opinion, I don't think Vaughn looked angry at Dirk at all. Now take a close listen to these Dirk lyrics. Even though I got a case, I'ma do what it takes. These are all definitely, definitely are evidence. Dirk isn't going to admit snitching on a Drake song. He might. That nigga's now let's take a close look at Dirk's attorney. Dead off Remember her face, song. okay? Now, let's take a closer look at King Vaughn getting searched at the airport. You can clearly see Lil Durk's attorney searching him. The woman searching Vaughn isn't Dirk's attorney. Vaughn would have recognized her and said something. The different this is a different photo of Dirk's attorney. She clearly isn't the woman in the video. First things first, y'all remember when Lil Durk turned himself in with the gray hoodie? Watch closely in this Vaughn song. He was wearing a gray hoodie just like Lil Durk when he turned himself in. Come on, bro. That, ain't, that don't even got shit to do with this, bro. Come on, bro. Just because he had on a gray hoodie? I think this dude is looking into things too much. There's no evidence. Dirt snitch, so the gray hoodie is probably meaningless. Yeah, bro. Nigga looking way too deep into the situation, bro. I need this nigga throwing the gray hoodie and all this shit into it. Like, bro, like, you is going way too far with the shit. Like, bro, a gray hoodie? I now just because Dirt had on a gray hoodie, fun put on a gray. Come on, bro. Like, that don't even got no type of correlation, bro. You just going way too far into this shit now. <laughs> Niggas just be doing this shit just for the video. I don't blame you, though. Get that cap off. The 
the reality is if you seen CCTV footage from the night Vaughn was killed, you know V. Vaughn, <laughs> my dumb ass said V. You know Vaughn wasn't sacrificed. Yeah, yeah, it was most definitely not a sacrifice for sure. If you watch, bro, if you really watch the clip, bro, if you really know what the fuck going on, bro, you know that shit ain't no sacrifice. Like, you know prior he ran up and hit the nigga. And you know what I'm saying? His homie shot. So how can why would they why would Lil Tim kill somebody for Dirk? And Lil Tim and Dirk weren't even homies. Like Lil Tim and Dirk weren't even cool. Like why though? That don't even make no sense. Why would he have somebody why would Lil Tim be the one? If Dirk was to set up King Von why would he have somebody that's not even from his camp kill him? You know what I'm saying? Won't you think if he sacrificed Vaughn, wouldn't you think it would be more secretive and wouldn't it be all a big camera thing where a whole bunch of people at? Like, don't you think if Dirk was going to really sacrifice this man, if Dirk really wanted to sacrifice him, it wouldn't be so televised and he wouldn't have some other dude that he don't even know kill Vaughn. Like, he would have killed him in a secret spot. Like, he would have took him somewhere, like, in a place where he didn't even know. Like, come on, bro. It wouldn't have been, like, right there at a nightclub in sack. Come on, bro. No way. No fucking way. Y'all got to listen to that shit, bro. Yeah. No way he could have been sacrificed. There ain't no plan. All that shit that happened that night was all in the spur of the moment. Spur of the moment type shit, bro. Ain't no no planning out. And nobody expect this shit to happen, bro. Like, all this shit that happened was, bro, was straight. Just straight spur of the moment, man. None of that shit was planned out, bro. No, no methodical nothing. None of that shit. Just straight spur of the moment. <laughs> These theories that dirt sacrifice Vaughn makes the grieving process way more harder for those close to Vaughn, particularly dirt. Yeah, man. Y'all need to stop putting out these theories, man. This shit crazy, bro. Y'all don't know how hard it is for people like like Vert, like Vaughn mom and Vaughn sister and siblings, or if he got a brother, or if he got, you know what I'm saying, his cousins. His uh his his kids his fucking kids you know what I'm saying his kids that he leaving behind like yeah I don't know how hard it is for them to not have a father their son their brother you know what I'm saying y'all gotta stop putting these fucking theories out saying he sacrificed this he's already hard enough that they gotta go through that and y'all niggas putting out sacrifice saying saying this bullshit sacrifice shit bro. Y'all gotta stop that shit. But anyway, man, if y'all like this video and y'all like this type of content, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and don't forget to don't forget to hit the bell, nigga. I'm out.